on October 7th, 2009, my mother raised her right hand and drew her last breath, and she died. But actually, my mommy left me a long time ago, in a way. You see, my mother was diagnosed with Alzheimer's disease 11 years ago. Alzheimer's is a good teacher, but a cruel one. And it taught me well. The last 11 years of my mother's life was full of a lot of changes and a lot of lessons. I learned not to say, remember mommy? Because mommy didn't remember. I learned to say, instead of, no, that's not the way it went. Then what happened? To whatever she would say. I would say, really, mommy? Then what happened? Basically, I learned to be with what was left versus to grieve what was lost. Alzheimer's is like a long summer day from the time that the sun is at its highest point, we're actually losing light, but we don't see the loss. We just realize that we look up and we are in darkness. Alzheimer's is like a thief in the night. You see, it goes into your house and moves you right out from underneath yourself, and it doesn't leave a forwarding address for all of the people who have loved ones who have taken this journey and had to face the painful reality that mommy or daddy doesn't live here anymore, then you know what I'm talking about. But this is not sad. Because as it relates to life, we none of us get out alive. I am excited to tell you that what my mommy taught me and what Alzheimer's taught me was to be with her in the process to not hold her hostage, to not hold the relationship hostage to the way that it had to be for me, to the things that I was used to mommy doing. I went from her caring for me to being honored to be trusted to care for her. There were many firsts, the time that I had to remind her that her mother had passed, the time that I had to remind her who I was she said to me, you're a pretty girl. Now, who do you belong to? I'm like, thanks for the compliment, Ma, but I'm yours. I learned to laugh in front of her and bawl my eyes out at night. But above it all, I learned, like I said, to be thankful, to be really thankful for the time. Alzheimer's took its time. It gave me time to grow up. It gave me time to really, really find my mother again. And you know what? I found that when I went looking for what was there, for where she was, when I went willing to meet her where she was, I always found her. So in that respect, Alzheimer's did not work. So I'll say, again, to those of you who are currently in this process, or if any situation, ailment, disease has taken a loved one away from you, if you've had to face, face the painful reality that they no longer live where they were, take heart. And if you are not in that situation, take heed and appreciate the people that you've got when you love them. For eventually, unfortunately, we'll all have to face the fact that mommy doesn't live here anymore. This is what I know so far.